I want to show you how you can handle uh, concurrency and I'm going to use the example um, from the previous video where we did the import um, for the data uh, on the pipe delimited file. And then all I did was I took out the pipe delimited file and I duplicated the lines over 200,000 rows. So I can just show you a concurrency example. Um, you can pretty much do this with, with anything that you're working with. Um, I just wanted to give you a quick example of how this works. So let's get started. And we're basically going to take the, the information that we have from our previous video where we're doing the inserts to the database uh, from reading the, the pipe delimited file. And we're going to run it concurrently. Now, one of the things I'm going to do is show you how you can actually do rate limiting as well in this video. So let me show you that. First thing we're going to do is set up our weight group variable. And we want to do that. And then we are going to make a slice that's going to hold all the information um, of how many are happening at the moment. So this is kind of where you want to set your, your, you know, your maximum uh, inserts here to the database at one given time. I think I have a local DB, so I need to keep it pretty low, but it, but it should give you a rough idea in it. In a, um, at 30 inserts per second or so, depending on how fast it reads the file. Um, what we want to do is now that we've got our variable, we basically want to take this block of data and we want to wrap this with all the calls for the um, weight group. So we want to say, okay, um, I want you to go ahead and add one and, and of the weight groups into the channel uh, for the slice. And then here I'm saying fire off in the fork in the background, this function, anything that's inside here is basically going to get fired off um, in the background. So we're going to put our data back in there. And then the other thing, let me just finish that is we actually have to pass in the parameters inside here because the scope is limited to what's inside here because it's forking in the background. So we need to pass in row at this point. So we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to um, pass in row, which I believe is a string. And the other thing is we want the weight group as well because we need to be able to tell this thing, hey, we're all done. So here we're going to do defer done. And then in here, uh, let's see what else we need. Oh, we need to be able to pass this data. So we're going to do row and then WG. So that's that basically is saying, you know, here's the parameters I'm going to pass in here and here's what they're defined. Cause this basically, basically builds a, a, a closure for, you know, um, this function is, is a closure in itself. So this is just the parameters being passed into this closure. So the other thing we need to do is while this thing fires off, you don't want the program to exit and be finished. So really what we need to do is we need to say, let's wait until everything's done. Um, as you queue up and you're only doing 30, per second, you basically want to queue up and wait until this thing's finished inserting before we're all done. Um, I think that's it. Let's see. Let's give it a shot. Oh, we got an issue. Um, let's see. 959. Okay. Oh, I forgot to dereference here. Let's go ahead and run that again. Oh, and I forgot to fill the channel need to do that. That's it. That's important. Otherwise, that's not going to work. Uh, let's do that. There we go. All right. So now it's doing at most uh, 30 per second. That's not per second. It's 30 uh, at once simultaneously and however fast that that can happen. And so it's basically this is an example of rate limiting and it's hammering into the database. Um, we can actually take a look and see where we're at. So right now I've got 37 of almost 30, I'll refresh again. I'm at 44,000 rows. 
Refresh again, I'm at 49,000. I mean, it's very, very fast. I'm gonna kill this off. That's a good example of how to do concurrency in Go. This is just one example with rate limiting. So I hope you like it. I'll see you guys in the next one.